Hey guys, welcome back to my channel. And for those of you who do not know me, my name is Jessica Christine and I do videos about a lot of different content such as law of attraction, self-help, self-development, veganism, fragrance videos, and so much more. <laughs> So if any of that interests you, then please hit the subscribe button. Um, in this video, I am doing an unboxing video that I received a package from Brandless. Now, this is not sponsored. I did order these myself. Um, I heard about this brand through a friend a couple of weeks ago, and I do do my own grocery shopping every single week. So. I'm always looking for new opportunities to save time and money, and I thought because this definitely saved me a ton of both, that I would share this video with you, and I thought it would be fun to do an unboxing video. So let's get into it. So Brandless is a brand that immediately caught my eye because it is extremely minimalistic. So every single item on their website is only $3, yeah three dollars it is insane I know um, so what I will be doing in this video is I will be comparing the brandless price to the price of the standard product slash brand that I would typically buy at like a Whole Foods or something like that um, and we will compare prices and see if brandless is actually a win like so many reviews do say online so, Brandless has a bunch of non-GMO, fair trade, cruelty free, and gluten free and vegan options on their website. They are all non-GMO, which is huge for me, and organic is also huge for me. You get free shipping on a $35 order or more. Um, you get free shipping for every order you make if you become a Be More member. So they do have a yearly membership like Thrive Market. Unlike Thrive Market, you do not need a membership to buy from them. Um, Brandless, you can order from them and not have a membership. But if you want to be, if you if you order from them and find that you do love their products and that you think that you will be purchasing from them in the future, it would be a financially smart decision to get the Be More membership because it is $36 a year and you get free shipping even if you want just one thing sent to you, like these dark chocolate quinoa bites that I probably will because <laughs> they're so good. Um, so yeah, that's that's a huge plus. And then also when you sign up for their Be More membership, they donate 10 meals on your behalf to those that are suffering from hunger. They have a partnership with Feeding America, which is the number one um, charity brand for those that are domestically starving, pretty much. Does that make any sense? Domestically starving. Probably not. Um, it's a great way for you to not only get your groceries, but to do your good deeds with charity. So it's it's a win-win in my opinion. I definitely will be doing that $36 a year membership. Um, and I will let you guys know what I thought of all of these products in a future video if that's what you want to see, if that's what you tell me in the comments, or what. <laughs> I'll probably do like little live videos on Instagram and um, tweets on Twitter, so follow me on there for all of that. Of course I am vegan. If you didn't know that, yes, I eat a plant-based diet and am vegan. And it is the healthiest diet ever and ever since I've been so happy. So I've been vegan for two years now and if you ever want to know little tips and tricks on that, let me know because I love to share them with you. I'm so big on it because it just makes me feel so good. But anyways, so all of these, that being said, all of these products in these two boxes, they're all vegan and the price, I believe you can't beat anywhere. So let's get into what I've bought. Next, let me just say I bought 34 products for $92.50. Like, that is unheard of, <laughs> at Whole Foods at least, let me tell you. Welcome to Brandless, little note. 
our incredible team scours the planet for the most amazing stuff. Oh, and it's all $3. How you ask? We started by eliminating brand tax, the hidden cost you pay for a national brand. So that is how they are getting those $3 products to your doorstep. Not only that, but they're also cutting the costs of having to store their products in a store. They are just shipping it from online. So it's completely different. So in this small box, there's only one thing <laughs> because all my other things are in here since I can't even lift it. I got blue corn tortilla chips. So let's open up this one. Look at all of this stuff in this box. Unbelievable. First thing I got, and like I said before, all, 100% all of these products are vegan, which is huge. I love that Brandless has such a great awareness of the vegan community. They even make it so easy for you because they have a vegan button on their website, a vegan filter that you just check off and it'll show you all of their vegan products all in one place. So you don't have to go searching through a store to find the products that you're looking for. It is so time saving and cost effective, this website. So I don't know if I'll ever actually go back. <laughs> we shall see. Um, I'm gonna try Thrive Market after this because I've heard a ton about that gro online grocery store as well. Um, I believe Thrive Market has produce on it. Brandless currently does not have any produce on it, which is the one thing that I would say um, they have to work on, but they are. They are just starting out. They're a brand new company. They're constantly adding new products, so I'm super excited to see how far they go with their brand. These are pretzel thins, everything flavor. The Pretzel Factory brand is the like everyday brand that you would typically buy in a store. Um, those are typically my ride or dies. I love the Pretzel Factory <laughs> so much. I love having these with hummus. And they have them in everything flavor, which is one of my favorites. They're non GMO vegan, no artificial colors or flavors, no artificial preservatives and they were three dollars <laughs> and it it is comparable to buying the pretzel factory price which i will leave all the comparable prices down here for you guys to see but if you're interested and you want to know how any of these products tasted please comment down below in the comment section and ask me questions let's interact with each other um, ask me how things were. Ask me any question that you possibly have. Pause this video right now and ask the question you have right now. <laughs> and we will talk about it. So, the next product is dried fruit and nut salad topper. So it has dried cranberries, sliced almonds, dried blueberries, pumpkin seeds, and sunflower seeds. And uh, they're vegan, obviously, 1.5 grams of fat. I always look at the fat content, and it's just awesome. All this stuff is, like, genuinely good for you. So you're not going to gain much weight from any of these products. It's just great. So I'm excited. I'll put this on my salad. I'll put it on, like... If you have acai bowls in the morning or yogurt, anything that you have, you can top this with, and I'm just super excited. Um, next product, dark chocolate quinoa bites. Um, they're vegan, and I go for anything chocolate that is vegan. Um, and these are just like a little good dessert, and they're great for traveling, which is why I picked them up. Um, and these are gluten-free as well, which is awesome for those of you who have celiac disease or just don't like to eat gluten in general. <laughs> I need to open these up right now. This I can't wait on, guys. Sorry. And this is how it looks. Mm. Oh my god. I instantly regret that decision because now I'm gonna eat the entire bag. Oh my god. Wow. These are a huge one. Huge one. Honestly. <laughs> wow. These are so friggin' good. These are to die for. 
I would definitely buy from Brandless again just for these. These are freaking $3 and you get like, you honestly get so much of them. There's a lot and they're little like, oh yes, big win. The dark chocolate quinoa bites, big win. The next products I got were pita chips. These are just so much healthier and the awareness of the brand is there and it's just a huge buy from a brand that takes into consideration all of these issues such as fair trade instead of buying from those conventional brands that really don't give a shit and only care about the money. And I will try these. These are so good. These are comparable to Stacy's pita chips and I honestly have to say that these are saltier than Stacy's which I love because salt is my favorite thing ever. I don't really get sweet tooths. I get more of a salty tooth and these are just hitting the spot. <laughs> so another win for Brandless. And now I have quinoa. So quinoa is a very, very important grain to have in your diet. Quinoa is extremely expensive to buy at Whole Foods where I shop. Um, and this was $3, so this was a huge win for me, like an enormous win. And then for my occasional sweet tooth, I got Fruit Mix Hard Candy. Now if you're vegan, you know that it is. It can be kind of difficult to find hard candy that is vegan, because a lot of them use uh, gelatin, which is um, animal fat, for more of a like smooth consistency. Um, and these are vegan, so I was very happy to see that. And um, yeah, they're a lot healthier than typical candies, I can tell you that much. I'm not gonna open these because I do wanna travel with these this weekend in the airport and I'd rather just have them not like spill everywhere. Next thing I got, gluten-free pizza crust that also happens to be vegan because a lot of gluten-free things are not vegan um, a lot of the time. So the fact that I found a vegan pizza crust that could also be catered to gluten, my gluten-free family and friends is huge. Um, if I ever want to make a pizza for anyone, I cannot wait to try this out, honestly. Um, and it tells you like how to make it down below. So I'm really excited to try this. I got, now I am going to absolutely butcher this name right now. Um, <laughs> Arabiata, Arabiata, Arabiata sauce. Arabiata, I think is how you say it. Could be just completely butchering that. Um, this is vegan, gluten-free, organic. It is awesome. Fat content, one gram, which is always what I look for. A lot of the times where you're gaining weight when you're eating pasta, it comes from what you're putting on the pasta. So are you eating meatballs? Are you eating a pasta sauce with a ton of olive oil in it, or oil in general, which makes the fat content skyrocket? What are you putting on it? Are you putting cheese on it? So ask yourself those questions before you think that the actual pasta is why you're gaining the weight. And I will compare it to other pasta sauces with this name if there is any out there. I got also butternut squash soup and I know it's a summertime and you're probably like why are you eating butternut squash soup in the summer but you know what I love squash and it's a vegan soup which is huge to me a lot of butternut squash soups have like some sort of dairy in it so I was super excited when I saw this and I can eat squash any time of the year and another fun fact about this soup is that there is zero grams of fat I try to be as low fat in my diet as possible. And in this soup, I got lentil, lentil soup, if you can see that. And this has 1.5 grams of fat, which is low enough for me. Anything under five grams of fat for me is completely fine. So I have a mix in here of not only food, but of like personal item, personal care items, uh, household items, stationary items, just I bought pretty much one thing from each category on the website. So I bought these recipe cards. It's a 50 count and I thought they were wicked cute. You can write like how many servings it has, the review of what you thought, notes about it, and all the ingredients you use. And you can just kind of store these recipe cards in a little book or journal. 
I bought Night Cream. I am so excited to try this. It's cruelty free. You can tell by the little bunny down here. All of their beauty products are cruelty free, which is huge to me. And I love using night creams. Uh, the size of this is 1.7 ounce. It was $3. So I will compare that to um, a typical night cream that I would use down here and would be sold at a different grocery store. The current uh, night cream I use, I buy from Whole Foods and it's like $28. So for $3, if this night cream works out for me, this is gonna be an absolute game changer. And I also got toothpaste. It is fluoride free, whitening, alcohol free, flea free, SLS free, and it's peppermint flavor and it's vegan. So that's really cool. I also got mouthwash, also fluoride free, alcohol free, SLS free, peppermint flavor. Uh, non-GMO so yeah I'm excited to try the mouthwash because I hate when mouthwashes like literally burn the inside of your mouth and it feels like oh my god my entire inside of my mouth is going to rip apart right now and usually those have like crazy chemicals in them so I'm super excited to try a natural mouthwash I also got a moisturizing conditioner. Now, if you have watched any of my other videos, I may have mentioned that I have a very oily scalp and very dry ends on my hair. I don't really have a normal like hair type at all. So it's a mixture. I never really know whether to go for like a more moisturizing shampoo or conditioner or more on the drying side, um, like an oil-free one. So I went with a moisturizing conditioner because my ends are a lot drier. I would never go with a moisturizing shampoo. <laughs> um, so this has green tea extract, no parabens, no animal testing, no bad chemicals. So I'm excited to try this out compared to another traditional moisturizing conditioner that you would buy in store right here. I also bought a facial cleanser. I love, must I just say, as I'm going through this box, I absolutely love the color of their packaging. They're all in like almost pastel colors and I think it's so minimal and so pretty at the same time. I don't know, I just love the packaging of Brandless so much. Good job. <laughs> um, so this facial cleanser, uh, antioxidizing fruit extract sulfate free no animal testing no harmful chemicals cruelty free of course so I'll compare the price of a regular uh, facial cleanser that you can get at like Target or Whole Foods any grocery store uh, down below here I also got um, pads so feminine products I got regular absorbency pads 100% organic cotton so that's huge for me because honestly, I just started using, I switch between like tampons and pads, um, kind of whatever mood I'm feeling in that day. But I just recently switched over to the organic side and let me tell you, it makes such a huge difference on me at least because I'm so sensitive. Um, and it's a fragrance and dye free, which is huge, hypoallergenic, chlorine free. So it's literally $3. To me, that's worth it. Um, you get 10 pads in this, and I'll compare like the price of other organic pads over here and the quantity, stuff like that. And I also got two boxes, <laughs> two boxes of tampons right here, can you see that? Yeah, so you get 10 tampons in each box. And um, yeah, it's 100% organic cotton, which I've never used organic ones before. So I can't wait to try them. You know, it's the little things when you're a girl sometimes like this. <laughs> so I'm excited to try them. And they're non-irritant, which is great. Mm, we're back to food because everything's mixed in. Uh, this I got vegetable broth and it comes in a three pack so you get three of these for three bucks and that is an unbelievable great deal um, and I use vegetable broth like all the time like 
instead of using oil, I'll use vegetable broth a lot of the times. That's a quick little tip, a little just tip and trick if you didn't know. Uh, vegetable oil can be used in place of oil. So yeah, I can't wait to have this. I feel like vegetable broth is vegetable broth, so it if you can get it cheaper somewhere, why wouldn't you? I also got two oatmeal cups, the apple cinnamon flavor, which is the only flavor oatmeal I like and will eat, which is might be a little weird to you guys, but the only brand that I actually, the only brand that I will actually eat oatmeal from is Nature's Path. Nature's Path apple cinnamon oatmeal is the best and I love it. I haven't had it in a while, but I was obsessed with them. But this is vegan as well and $3 for two. So um, I will compare the price down here and I'll let you know how this is. I also got body wash. Um, no animal testing, sulfate free, soothing oatmeal extract. So I can't wait to use this body wash. I love how every single product so far has been like a different color. I think that's so cool. And I got body lotion. This is an enormous body lotion. This is 280 milliliters. Like this is big. I don't know if you can tell on camera, but it, it's, it's a big body lotion. It's like the size of my head. So yeah, it has soothing aloe, no parabens, no animal testing, all good stuff in here. Um, let me test this out actually. I'm gonna try it right now. See if I like it, because I, I like real moisturizing lotions. All right, so I put that much on my hands. Let's see. Mm, it smells so natural. It smells like, it has an aloe scent to it actually, kind of. If you like very light scented lotions and moisturizing lotions, you will love this lotion. It is extremely moisturizing, which is a great thing. I definitely think I'll be using this a lot. And it's good when you're going to bed if you are sensitive to smell because this doesn't have like a strong scent to it at all. It has a very natural, soothing, more like essential oil like scent to it, if that makes any sense. So I definitely am glad that I purchased this and it's not sticky, which is important to me. Not a sticky lotion. Thank you, Brandless. And I also bought creamy peanut butter. It's organic, vegan, everything like that. Um, peanut butter, organic peanut butter in general is extremely expensive to buy in grocery stores, um, especially Whole Foods. <laughs> So when I saw this for $3, this is an automatic win. I don't even have to taste it, and I know that it's an automatic win. You can tell it's a natural peanut butter because of the natural oils at the top of it. Um, this is probably one of Brandless's biggest wins if I had to just say one without checking the um, traditional prices in grocery stores. This is a great buy. Buy your peanut butter from Brandless. <laughs> I also bought panty liners um, from there for when you are, what I like to say, spotting. <laughs> you don't know if you've gotten it yet or you, you don't know if it's gone yet, but you don't want to go through the whole full process of preparing, if you know what I mean. <laughs> so I got these, they're organic cotton, uh, fragrance and dye free, hypoallergenic, you know the deal. Same with the pads and tampons, it's great. And I also got two hand soaps, um, which was also a great deal, um, in the scent Eucalyptus and Lavender, and I got two of them, so that's awesome. And they're the foaming hand soap, which is my favorite, like the Bath & Body Work type, um, but I don't buy from Bath & Body Work because they're not cruelty free. Um, but these are, so I'm super excited to wear these. And then I bought two things of facial tissues, and these were two for $3, which was awesome. These are tree-free facial tissues, which is awesome, so you're not killing any trees. It's just great. Another great thing that Brandless is doing is being environmentally friendly. 
So that's awesome. And I can't wait to use these. <laughs> I also got three things of kidney beans for $3, which is a great deal. Um, they're typically a dollar in grocery stores, so I would say this is an even deal, and it's it's great. Um, so yeah, it's easy. Don't have to go through a store searching for beans. And then I got the same thing in black beans, which I eat all the time. And then it comes in this box. I got, haha, -ha, look out. <laughs> um, I got a bread knife. So that's great because I eat a shit ton of bread. Honestly, I love bread. Bread is my weakness. Bread always, every meal. Um, and I don't have like a good knife that cuts bread. So I got this and I cannot wait to use this. I'll let you know how the knives are. I'm very interested to know like if they're cheaply made or what. Um, but yeah, this seems pretty legit to me, so we'll see. And I got chunky salsa, um, zero fat, which is great. There is no oil in this, which I love. I love oil-free things. So I got the vegan chunky salsa, comparable to traditional brands, which I will have down below. And then one of the things that I am most excited for is the apple cider vinegar with the mother, which is so excited. If you know me, you know that I am absolutely obsessed with apple cider vinegar. And I always tell people, buy the Bragg brand because it's the only one that comes with the mother and it's the only one that is genuinely healthy for you. You need the mother for this to be actually, get all the benefits from apple cider vinegar, which is amazing for you. <laughs> I won't get into that because then this video will be way, way, way longer. But yeah, this is raw unfiltered with the mother organic apple cider vinegar. This stuff is expensive expensive in the grocery store and this is 16 fluid ounces this is a very good size also pretty much the size of my head um, and yeah as you can see in the bottom all of this gross stuff or it looks gross is actually so healthy for you and yeah I'm so excited to try this because if this is a win if this tastes the same and it's three dollars I will never go back to brag sorry brag but it's just the same thing <laughs> minus your brand name all right guys that'll do it for this video thank you guys so much for watching and if you made it through this video for this long thank you so much it is so appreciated and yeah I overall think brandless is an amazing brand I would 110 percent recommend you purchase from them once again this video is not sponsored they have no clue that I'm making this video <laughs> um, I just discovered this brand two weeks ago and I get very excited over brands that are environmentally friendly offer vegan options for people and just have a minimalistic um, brand feel to them so thank you guys so much for watching once again let's start a conversation in the comments down below tell me what you think about this video tell me what products you would buy what products you wouldn't buy what you thought about the price range like do you think it seems like a good brand would you buy from them what do you think and I'm going to also be on Twitter starting conversations about this so if you don't follow me on Twitter make sure you do I will have my Twitter handle right up here it's just Christine x3 same as on Instagram so follow me on there as well um, on Twitter let's use hashtag just Christine brandless and see what we can do there let's start talking and getting brandless's attention and thanking them for all the great products that they make don't forget to hit the subscribe button hit the bell 
comment down below share this video if you found any value from it and give me a thumbs up most importantly if you enjoyed this video that is what helps me determine which videos I should be making more of in the future if you enjoyed this video what you didn't enjoy from it if you dislike it it just helps so much so thank you guys for all of your feedback you know that I always want your feedback it is so important to me and helps me to know what you guys like and are interested in so I can make more of that for you so thank you guys so much for watching I love you guys and I'll see you in my next video bye